FC manager paralyzed during a 2008 robbery along South Avenue has died. Joe Calusa passed away earlier today. The city of Youngstown rallied around the Calusa family for years after he was shot while on his way to make a bank deposit. The suspects were caught after a camera on a WRTA bus helped police identify the car, which had cut him off before the shooting. Teron Helms and Hattie Gilbert received 50-year sentences for the crime. But Calusa was paralyzed from the waist down and lived seven years that way before passing away today. Joe loved YSU football. I'll never forget meeting him at the Canfield Fair after the accident. Joe Calusa, dead just shy of his 50th birthday. Joe's wife, Lisa, died two years ago.